morning guys so today well we are blurry for today's video i'm getting ready to head over to the thrift shop because i'm actually looking for some blazers it's winter right now and you know it's cold and i wanted to find some really cute blazers because i was going to splurge on some um, from some other websites before I did I wanted to hop over to the thrift store because I know they always have really cute blazers like vintagey looking blazers and that's what I'm looking for so I'm like hmm, before I pay an arm and a leg for one brand new one let me go hit up the thrift shop and see if they have any good ones that I could use but first coffee okay we are not about to do any of this without the influence right now because I don't want to lose sight of what I'm here for which is blazer. So, ooh, what's this? Anyways, I think that's it. Let me head over to the fitting room and try some of these on. Okay. Alright guys, so this is the first blazer. I really like it. Look how oversized it is. And I love the pattern as well. Sorry if it's a little dark by the way. I, I tried to put the ISO as high as I could but I don't know if it's still looking really dark. Feels very vintage and it has these shoulder pads that aren't like too crazy. This one is $8 stripe design. Also has shoulder pads. I'm gonna try this one on next, so we'll see. one I'm definitely taking it this one comes out to be $2 250 because it has a pink tag and it has like this houndstooth design and then it's like textured and it has like a little feather rim here it's so cute next I have this Garfield and Max one this one's really pretty I love the color it might look like a periwinkle blue but it's definitely a lavender in person only five bucks so I really hope this one looks good because I like it I have this other pinstripe black one by the brand Katie Brook. This one is $5. This one by the brand Sage Harbor Petite. I love the petite ones because I'm petite and I always feel like they just fit me a little bit better. It's definitely oversized, which I like. And I just feel like this would look so cute with like some jeans and some nice heels. But like that vintage gentleman look all right guys so i'm back in the car so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna show you guys the things that i got i figure i'll just make this a goodwill haul because as i was trying things on i thought to myself it would probably be a good idea to split this video into two parts where the first part is me actually shopping and taking you guys with me and the second part is me actually styling the items and showing you kind of like a goodwill thrift shop kind of lookbook with the things that I purchased because I just don't want this video to be too extremely long plus I don't want to have to wait forever to put this video up and I know it's going to take me another few days to get a lookbook going for you guys so I'm going to haul the items that I picked up the first thing I ended up going with was this lavender um blazer I showed you guys this one at the dressing room there's somebody watching me so it's a little weird this one was five dollars so that's a really, really good price. I figure this will be a really cute item to style like 
in the springtime i think this color is so cute it looks really periwinkle on camera but it's not periwinkle it's definitely a lavender which i really like wearing lavender in the springtime i did end up purchasing this houndstooth um style like jacket i don't really think this is a blazer this one was five dollars and i do like the fact that this one does give me a little bit more shape because it has the little tie which cinches at the waist this is oh shit i just started it with my lipstick now well, it's fine i have to wash these things anyways i noticed i picked up a lot of that like houndstooth print i'm just now noticing that this was so cute this is definitely unlike anything that i have and i knew i had to have this because for one it was only two dollars and girl i'm not about to say no to a bargain like that this is definitely a more fitted like a shorter type of blazer i like it because this, this definitely is really really cute and perfect for work um or even if you're doing like a business brunch a business meeting i think this is so so stinking cute so picked up this black blazer which i knew i had to have it has like the pinstripes going down it has really really thin stripes um but this one is definitely not as thick as the others it's definitely a more thin material which i like about it because i feel like i'll be able to wear it in the spring maybe not so much the summer but definitely the spring i would probably pair this with some biker shorts and like a belt on the waist and like some glasses or maybe like a newsboy hat um i thought this was so 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 cute this is by the brand katie brook i don't know what size it is but it does have the shoulder pads which i like because it does give it that like vintagey feel and then the last piece that I got is probably my favorite one of them all because it's unlike anything that I have in my collection. And this one was also $2.50. This, because it was on sale, it was originally $5, but I got it for half off, so it became $2.50. I love this blazer. This is definitely the vibe that I was going for when I came to the thrift store today. I wanted something that was a little bit more vintage-y, something that looks expensive, feels expensive, but isn't expensive. It does have the shoulder pads, which, of course, I really like. It has these, like, checkered almost houndstooth type of print i feel like everything i got was like houndstooth print definitely different because it is a little bit more of a camel-y brownie type of color which i really like i don't have any camel or brown blazers but i love this so much i'm excited to pair this at the moment i'm not entirely sure how i would but we shall have to see not gonna lie i feel like i really had a very successful thrift shop run i gotta say sometimes I'm a little weary about doing these kind of videos because not always do you find the things that you say you're gonna go out and find so a lot of times it ends in disaster when you try to do things like this. But I'm not going to lie, the thrift store gods, they came through for me. They were on my side today. I'm not going to complain. I really, really like all the things that I picked up today. I was not expecting to find that many nice blazers. So shout out to goodwill for being on my side i hope you guys enjoyed this video i want to encourage all of you guys to go to the thrift store i really like coming to them because you can find a lot of cute vintage pieces that really nobody else has not only that but goodwills for the most part usually do help out the community guys i want to thank you so much for watching don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and of course don't forget to subscribe and hit the little notification bell because that way you will be notified when i post videos especially the part two of this video which will be a lookbook i want to thank you guys so much for watching this video and of course, I will see you in my next one. Bye.